Hello and welcome to another episode here on my channel. My name is Cam Small and today we are taking a look at the cube in the boss rush of Lost Ark. Well, actually it's just a cube, but it's the same mechanic. So if you're wondering how you unlock the boss rush, it is the same way on how you unlock the cube. Now, before we start, quick note, this is the early access version of Lost Ark, which was kindly provided to me by Amazon, so I could play the game before. But everything you are seeing here will also work in the same way when the game is released. What you are seeing also here is the entrance ticket to the cube which you are finding in the Chaos Dungeon. So you have to find that first and when you have found the ticket you will actually get a guide quest which you can see right here uh, which you have to accept and then you can go to the cube and you can unlock the cube interface. So what you have to do first is you have to get level 50 you have to go into some chaos dungeons and then you have to find an entrance ticket. And yes, that is completely random. You cannot control when the tickets drop. Uh, my first ticket dropped around 20 tries. I think this was after 20 tries. So it took me quite a bit to actually get my ticket. You can also see there are different tiers of the cube. It starts with tier 1, then tier 2, and then tier 3. And of course, you always need a different ticket. You will also get in the different tiers of the Chaos Dungeon. And then you can decide, okay, do I want to do this with random people? Do I want to do this with friends? Or do I want to do this on my own? And well, in this video, I had to do it on my own because I didn't find anyone else who wants to do a cube and it, it just works. Now, when you are in the cube, you have to go through multiple arenas and you have one life. When you die, it's over. You're getting kicked out of the cube and you have to find a new entrance ticket to get into the cube again. And you have to fight through 10 stages in total. And I can actually show you the interface here because my cam is in the way. But the interface looks like this. And you have a timer to clean up the arena. And then when you have cleaned up the arena, you will get a treasure box or you will unlock a treasure box. And the more stages you clear, the more valuable the treasure box becomes. Now the question is, of course, okay, what happens if I die before I reach stage 10? What happens to my treasure boxes? Good news, the game is not punishing you. You would just get all the treasure boxes which you would have gotten till stage 9. So there is really no reason to leave the cube before you die. Like even if you die, you just get the treasure box you would have gotten at stage 9 if you would have clicked on leave the cube. Like there is there is no punishment. And yeah, you of course want to reach stage 10 because it gives you most of the resources. Also very important to note, which is kind of interesting, whenever you are going into a next stage, this arena might have some boss fights or some special enemies. Or as you can see, I got a lucky bonus. And that lucky bonus actually gives me a huge buff on my damage and my crit, which is fantastic, right? Yeah, unfortunately, you can also be unlucky and then you get a debuff and that debuff can be murder. Like you can get like a debuff that you are permanently blind and you barely see anything or you get double damage or, so, or you're super slow. Like some of those debuffs are not fun at all. And um, yeah, be, be worried about those things. Unfortunately, you can't really do anything to control them and they just happen. So... That's that. But that's how the cube works. And that's basically the same thing on how the boss rush works. But instead of running through a 10 stage cube, you are trying to kill a boss super quickly. But it is the same interface. It is the same system. And it's just a different thing. But with that said, that's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. If I've missed something or you have some questions, let me know down below in the comments. And if you are new here, I would appreciate if you might leave a like if you enjoyed this video. And if you want to see daily gaming news, more tips and tricks videos, reaction videos, and of course tons of um, more Lost Art content, I would appreciate if you might consider to subscribe to the channel. 
If you ever want to watch me live, you can do so from Monday to Friday, starting at 9 a.m. East Coast time, which is 2 p.m. UK time and 3 p.m. Central European time over at Trovo live slash chaos well, you will find the link in the video description and we are always talking about gaming news in the morning and then we are actually playing a lot of new games in this case mostly lost arc in the next few weeks so again thank you so much for watching stay safe and i hope i see you next time